What's up guys, I just got a game called Metro Last Light, and I got into it, and uh, it had a few problems with the graphics. Um, I have an Intel HD 3000 graphics card, and it didn't seem to work too well with the DirectX 11 in the game. And if you're having this problem and you don't know how to fix it, then... I'm going to show you a way to do it. Sorry for that, my computer just froze. Um, okay, so first, what you're going to want to do is well, let me explain the problem. The problem is the characters are look glitchy. They have all these crazy spiky lines coming out of them. Um, I've heard I've never played Minecraft, but I saw somebody posting about the problem and they said it looked like Minecraft characters. I'm not sure. But uh they have all these spiky lines coming out of them in every direction. Uh and it, I just couldn't play looking at that. But here's how you fix it. What you're gonna do is you wanna press Windows R Type C colon that thing backwards slash whatever it is users your name or whoever the user is on your PC it's not going to be mine app data local 4A space games metro space LL just want to hit enter that's going to pull up this uh, folder that has a bunch of numbers and uh, letters in it just going to click on that I've got mine set to red only Hold on. sorry for the background my mom and my brother so don't just tune them out um, what you want to do is you want to open up the user file. There's a file like this in your game folder on Steam or wherever your folder is that has your game in it. And if you edit what I'm going to do here, then it's not going to affect the game at all. I figured that out. You're going to want to go down, scroll down until you find R underscore API. It's either going to be one or two. Let's put it in one. You're going to want to change that one or two to a zero, and that's going to force the game to run in DirectX 9 that is compatible with your card, and that will fix it. If your game has trouble uh, with FPS, then what you can do is you can go change the screen resolution to 640. 480. When you're done with that, just hit Control S or Save. Doing it a few times. Exit out of that. Right click on User. Hit Properties. Hit Red Only and Apply. I have a video that I made on how to get better performance out of your Intel HD graphics card. And it's got a few tips on battery uh, settings and some programs that you can use. So go check that out. And I hope this fixed your problem. It fixed mine. So that's it.